You don't have to drive far down a gravel road on a windy day in North Dakota to see the towers spinning. It's when you drive out in the country, you see them. I guess it's the future. The future appears to be coming to the little town of Wishick. They're talking about 75, around 75 towers. The company Orsted wants to build the proposed Badger Wind Farm around the small town. Discussions have been happening for nearly five years. A couple hesitation on farmers, but for the most part, I'd say it's been a good feedback. They're too close to the city. I'm not sure what effect they will have on the city. If the project gets the green light, Wishick city leaders say the town of just under 900 people would see a slight windfall every year of the farm's expected 30-year lifespan. We've already gotten money for our civic center here to redo the bathrooms, and I know the school is supposed to be getting some money, and I know the ambulance and the fire department are supposed to be getting some money to benefit from this. Vickers says Wishick School District would receive around $300,000 from the project, as would Logan and McIntosh counties in tax dollars. The towers would mostly surround Wishick. Most of the farm would sit north of town. It's expected to generate around 1,081,000 megawatts a year and would connect to Montana Dakota Utilities power grid. As of right now, I, what I've been told is that they're still waiting for the uh, state to give them their final final paperwork. Wishick town leaders I spoke to say that if approved, the closest wind tower has to stay at least a mile and a half outside the city. Right now, it appears the project is waiting on approval from the state, and that could happen at the end of this month. In Wishick for KX News, I'm Joel Porter.